Shi News nationwide. Chief of Defense Staff General Christopher Musa has issued a stern warning to protesters, declaring that the armed forces are ready to confront all threats to the Nigerian state. General Musa stated this in Abuja at a joint media briefing of heads of security agencies and explained that armed forces are united in their resolve to deal with any attempt to destabilize the country. Our correspondent Fumilola Adeyemi has details. Chief of Defence Staff, General Christopher Musa, and heads of security agencies converge on the conference hall of the Defence Headquarters for the much-needed update on happenings in the country. After a welcome remark by the Chief of Defence Staff, the Inspector General of Police IGP Egbetokun ampered on protesters flying foreign flags. I want to use this opportunity to warn our youths to desist from accepting foreign flags from agents of destabilization. It is very, very implicating for them to be seen with flags of other countries while on protest. Service chief made their stand known while pledging their commitment to safeguarding nation's democracy. I want to remind all Nigerians that while it is a constitutional right to participate in peaceful protest, it is also an offense and a crime to engage in disorder, violence, and chaos. And it is also the responsibility of the armed forces and other security agencies to ensure that violence, disorder, and chaos do not prevail and will ensure that this does not happen. We share in the hopes and aspirations of Nigerians for better governance, which the president has also enunciated in the recent speech he made. The speech clearly brought out the intention of the president and the president administration towards addressing the issues of poverty and hardship that are facing Nigerians. On our part, the armed forces of Nigeria, we've been doing all that we need to do to ensure that we provide the enabling environment to support Mr. President and this government in the attainment of this objective of reducing poverty and hardship in this country. I want to, on behalf of the officers and soldiers of the Nigerian Army, state unequivocally that the Nigerian army stand assured in defense of our democracy, of our peace, of our harmony, and we are not going to shift ground on that. On our part, Controller General of Nigeria Immigration Service, C.G. Kemi Nadab, explained that diaspora sponsors of the protest are being monitored. Some of these... Um sponsors, some of these people who are actually in diaspora, we have a number of them who are actually instigating this uh, mayhem that we're seeing right now. What we've done is we've had them on our watch list and they've been watch listed. We have them on our radars and uh, we're making sure that any attempt they make to come into the country will notify the, the, the necessary authority. And we're working closely, of course, with the NIA and uh, DSS, of course, and um, the NSA's office, so that all those we have in diaspora that are actually trying to subvert the authority of this nation, we are, we are in our readers, we have them watchlisted, and uh, any attempt they make to come into the country will be notified and um, will also know what to do. Chief of Defense Staff, General Musa, then read the riot out to those taking advantage of the protest. We are only after those that are against the state not those that are innocent. So I want to make that very clear. We'll continue to work together as a team to support Mr. President in achieving his mandate of peace and tranquility in our dear country, Nigeria. Although normalcy appears to have been restored in many parts of the country, security chiefs are leaving nothing to chance. Fumilola Adeyemi, ADBN News.